Our Primetime 5 looks at the weekend gone by in NAIA football. That's today on Midwest Sports Now. Honorable mention goes to Morningside. The number one team in the country saw AP Ponder have 26 carries for 158 yards and three touchdowns. The Mustangs defeated Briar Cliff 49-14 on Saturday. Quarterback Joe Dolinchek also was 21 of 25 passing for 342 yards and a pair of touchdowns as well. Dones, Isaiah Celestine, had six receptions for 109 yards and one touchdown. The Tigers defeated Jamestown 29-21. And that takes us to our primetime five, number five tonight. It's Sterling. The Warriors' defense, well, they get the recognition tonight. They held the Falcons to just 16 yards as Sterling defeated Friends 22 to nothing on Saturday. The Warriors are now 5-1 and one on the year. To our number four spot tonight, it is Langston with Tim Whitfield in the backfield for the Lions. 28 carries, 226 yards, and three touchdowns in a win over Arizona Christian. The Lions handled the firestorm 34-16. Langston now 4-1 and one overall, 3-0 three and, three and oh in conference play. To our number three spot, Northwestern. Quarterback Tyson Kuima. Well, on the ground, he had 19 carries for 125 yards and a pair of touchdowns. Through the air, he was 15 of 17 passing, just one interception, 164 yards, and two more touchdowns in the win. Northwestern defeated Dort 35-6. To, to the number two spot, Kansas Wesleyan Johnny Foto. That is the man of the hour for the Coyotes, who took down the Spires in a big way on Saturday to the tune of 90 to nothing. And even when you put in second stringers and third stringers in a win like this, someone's going to come up with big numbers. And that person on Saturday was Foto. He was efficient, completing 19 of 26 passes and threw for 397 yards. He connected with receivers for six touchdowns on the day. That's Johnny Foto and Kansas Wesleyan now moves to 6-0 and oh on the season. Our number one spot in the primetime five for this weekend, that is reserved for Oklahoma Panhandle State. The Aggies got a 34-28 double overtime win over Texas Wesleyan on homecoming. And it does bring to mind the old UPS slogan, what can Brown do for you? Well, think about this for the Aggies. Quarterback Tony Brown had 35 carries for 155 yards and two touchdowns in regulation. He also had the game-winning touchdown in overtime. Jay Sean Brown had three receptions for 17 yards and one touchdown, and that touchdown catch was a big one as it was the game-tying touchdown in the fourth quarter that made the score 28 apiece. And Malik Brown on the defensive side of the ball for the Aggies intercepted a Texas Wesleyan pass in the first overtime, shutting down the Rams' offense. That brings us to the second overtime, where when the Aggies got the ball, Tony Brown had carries of 16 yards, then five yards, then three yards, and then the one-yard touchdown dive to put the Aggies on top, 34-28. The defense would hold, and Panhandle State got the win on Saturday, a much-needed win, the Aggies' second win of the season. That is a look now at the Prime Time 5 on Midwest Sports Now. I'm Joey McWilliams. Thanks for watching. I do encourage you to like and subscribe to this channel, Midwest Sports Net. God bless you. Have a great one.